When I Was One and Twenty by A. E. Hausman, 1859 to 1936. When I was one and twenty, I heard a wise man say, Give crowns and pounds and guineas, but not your heart away. Give pearls away and rubies, but keep your fancy free. But I was one and twenty, no use to talk to me. When I was one and twenty, I heard him say again, The heart out of the bosom was never given in vain. Tis paid with sighs a plenty, and sold for endless rue, and I am two and twenty, and oh, tis true, tis true. Okay, this poem is by Alfred Edward Hausman. Um, he was a, a classical scholar, he was a Latin scholar. Um, he taught uh, Latin at Cambridge University. Um, okay, so let's see, he came from uh, Worcestershire and I think spent um, uh, much of his time in Birmingham and Shropshire. Okay, so what's this about? Well, this poem is about um, don't fall in love. This is, I think, what the poem is saying. If you fall in love, love will only get, bring you pain. Love will only bring you sorrow. Um, and better give your money away, give anything away, but don't give your heart away. Because if you give your heart away, then you will, you will suffer for it. And the poem is about um, Hausman receiving advice from a wise person. And this wise person says, um, don't give your heart away. Give away your possessions, but not your heart. Because if you do, then you are going to suffer. And then the second verse, um, Hausman sa uh, says, well, I didn't, uh, so he didn't listen to this and he did fall in love and now he knows that this person was right. Okay, so when I was one and twenty, when I was twenty-one, so Hausman's twenty-one years old, it's actually interesting that this poem was, um, I think it was written and published when he was thirty years old. Okay, so it's, I think it's looking back, yeah? Okay, when I was one and twenty, I heard a wise man say, Give crowns and pounds and guineas, but not your heart away. So when I was 21, a wise p man said to me, Give crowns, um, a crown I think was five shillings, uh, and pounds and guineas, I think a guinea was 21 shillings, give away your money, but not your heart away, but don't give your heart to anyone. Give away pearls, give rubies, but keep your fancy free, yeah? But don't fall in love. Keep your, your, your fancies, the, the desires of your heart, keep them free. Don't fall for anyone. But I was one and twenty. No use to talk to me. So, but I was twenty-one and it was no use talking to me because I wouldn't listen. So this no use it was no use to talk to me this is saying i didn't follow this advice yeah and i think this is implying that then uh he actually under after that he understood so um he later he understood that this advice was right that it was the right thing and then there's this transition from this to the next part when i was one and twenty I heard him say again, the heart out of the bosom was never given in vain. So he's saying, when I was 21, the man said, if you give your heart from, from, you, from inside you, from your breast, from the inside of you, um, there is always something to pay for that. Yeah, it won't, it won't be for nothing. It won't be in vain. 
Tis paid with sighs a plenty, and sold for endless rue. So if you give your give your heart away, then um, you will end up sighing and being sad. Oh, oh dear. So it is paid with sighs a plenty. You will sigh. You will be unhappy, and sold for endless rue. Rue is a bitter herb, but to rue the day, to be very sad about something. Yeah, this is related to ruin. Ruin is a herb. Yeah, okay, so if you give away your heart, you will have endless sadness. And I am two and twenty, but now I'm twenty-two. And oh, tis true, tis true. And now I know what he said is true. So I've been through this experience. I, I fell in love with someone. And now I know that falling in love um, has its downside. And if you give your heart to someone, you will end up suffering. And suffering is the result of falling in love. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. When I Was One and Twenty by A. E. Houseman.